It's the G to the U to the R to the U. I want to talk about the greatest hype, man. The hype, man. What I call this man? The, the, what did I call him? Don't believe the hype. That's what I did. I forgot, man. I forgot because I don't even want to talk about this guy. Matthew Stafford. Matthew Stafford. And I'm telling you, ladies and gentlemen, please don't believe the hype. Don't believe the hype. What y'all doing right now? Like, this dude is the number one staff stuffer in NFL history. Like, I've been watching Matthew Stafford. I give it to him. If, he, if there's a Hall of Fame of stat stuffers, Matthew Stafford will be a first ballot stat stuff in Hall of Fame ever. Like, history. I mean, I've seen this dude throw for 5,000 yards. I mean, I've, I've seen it all, man. I, I've seen it all, bro. When it comes to stats. But this dude is not special. So that's why I keep saying, don't believe the hype. What you guys are doing, this is not special. You know what special is? I'm going to tell you what special is. Special is that Joe Burrow. When you go to an organization, who lose? Who sucks? Like the, the, like the Cincinnati Bengals. And you change the whole surface like that. Boom. Just like that. That's called special. Special is when you're Kyler Murray. You go to the Arizona Cardinals. A culture. You're like, what the hell is going on over there? Then boom. You're like, oh my God. That's special. That's what special do. They change the culture. They change organization special. Matthew Stafford is good. There's nothing. He's good. He's very good. He's good. But the hype, that hype trend is coming because I already know, you know me, I'm the guru. I see things before, before it happens because I know what's going to go on. It's about to be the Matthew Stafford hype train. I'm about to get the DM. Yeah, I know, I know who I'm talking to. I'm about to get the DM. Oh, you see what Matthew Stafford did? This and that. You know what? I know what Matthew Stafford's going to do. I've seen this before. Stuffing stacks, man. That's why he used to always play on Thanksgiving, man. Stuffing turkeys, man. Matthew Stafford, I've seen him throw for 5,000 yards. Stupid touch. Like, I've seen this all in Detroit, man. But you know what I've been seeing? He has, you know, he's not special. He didn't change the culture. So what's happening right now is Matthew Stafford is in, uh, in Los Angeles. There's no major difference. Kirk Cousin could get the line. The Rams will have the same record that Kirk Cousin. They are with Matthew Stafford right now. Guarantee it, bro. Guarantee it. Any quarterback with competency with this roster with the Rams would be up, uh, 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 would do would do well, bro. Trust me. Last year, they won the playoff with Jared Goff, man. And some other guy, we don't even know who his name is right now, man. Yeah, they want a playoff game with that. So it's not because of Matthew Stafford, the Rams are doing. No, 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 no. Please don't believe the hype. I'm just letting you know. Don't believe the hype. I've seen this before, bro. Don't believe that. But when it comes down to the come down, man, you know what I'm saying? And the playoff when the time matters, that's when we're gonna let we're gonna judge Matt Stafford. So right now in the regular season, y'all Matthew Stafford fanboy, y'all could have it, man. Y'all could have it, man, because I told you. Hey, I will tell you, you're a Matthew Stafford fanboy. Y'all could have it. Matthew Stafford is the number one. If there's a Hall of Fame of stat stuffers, I'm talking about Matthew Stafford is the first ballot Hall of Fame stat stuffer, man. Don't believe the hype. Don't believe the hype. Trust me, I've seen it. This dude could put up stats. So what he's doing right now with the Rams? Nah, man, I ain't falling for that trap, man. I ain't falling for that trap, man. I've seen Jared go. You could put any quarterback with competency in the Rams roster right now, and I guarantee you, man, the Rams should be uh, six and one right now. I guarantee you, bro. Guarantee our worst five and two, man. Same with same place where they are right now. Second place in the division with any quarterback. So please don't believe this hype, man. I know they're like, damn, Guru, you be killing staff, or you be killing. Look, man. Look, look, look. I don't be killing staff. I said Matthew Staff is a good quarterback. I like good quarterback. Look, my last quarterback I was, you know, you know, in a in a, in a quarterback ship with was Kirk Cousin. He's an average quarterback. So I don't diss averageness. You know what I'm saying? I just moved on to something better. To Joe Burrows. You know what I'm saying? I moved from average to special, baby. I'm moving on up and moving on up to Cincinnati. Woo-wee. Hey, baby, I'm out to get an apartment in the QC, baby. To be closer to my boy, Joe Burrows. <laughs> oh, man. Let's move on, man. Let's move on. On a serious matter now, man. 